Hi, this is Florian, and I will show you a quick demo of Idavis, a Python library for data exploration and visualization. First, Idavis is integrated into your workflow, namely the Jupyter Notebook. First, we import the library. In the second cell, we get a classic Titanic data frame, so a pandas data frame. And now we get an overview of the data frame. What's important here is you get a, click, a quick exploration without coding, so it's very easy to get started. In the glimpse in the first tab, you will see an overview in general and about the columns and, for example, missing values color-coded. Also, Edavis is very interactive, so you can filter and sort interactively. In the second tab, you can see the columns and you can drill down into columns. So let's understand age. Age is numeric, so we're shown a histogram, and we can actually rebind the histogram if we like. Also, we can drill down into the missing values, but let's focus on this later. Let's say you want to predict if a person survived or not. 60% died, 40% survived on the Titanic. So let's see what are good predictors. And the columns are sorted by their predictive power, and the best predictor is on top. The best predictor is sex. If you have a look at sex, you see it's 64 to 35. And now the important thing is to understand why it is such a good predictor. And we can do this here. The mosaic plot explains the predictive power. Because if you're male, you rather died, and if you're female, you rather survived. As you can see, Edavis always adjusts to the data types. And you get explanations why there are such good predictors. In the third tab, you get an interactive cross filter where you can highlight subsets like all the people in the first class or all the medium age people. In the fourth tab, you can see patterns between the data, between the columns, so predictive patterns. And this is based on the predictive power score, which has advantages over correlation. But we will explain this in a separate video. Here you see the heat map, and you can drill down into something that interests you. And of course, you get an explanation again. Let's say you found something that you like. Then you can disaggregate the report and create your own report. The plot function here, it's very flexible because you can see that you don't need to specify that you want to have a mosaic plot. Let's change, let's change the column to age. And it changes. Let's change to fair. And it changes again. This plot I really like a lot because it's better than a classical scatter plot. Because this has overplotting. Wrapping up, we hope that Edavis helps you to quickly understand your data and understand it deeply. Edavis library is in private alpha. If you'd like to try it yourself, please subscribe to the rating list. Thank you.